Wednesday, June 13th, 2018. I'm John Knox. I'm in Long Beach, California. Now, I'm an activist, but Chris Haskell is an amazing anti-geoengineering activist in Tucson. Recently, we found out that Chris, who has been doing amazing amounts of work over the years, posting thousands of anti-geoengineering signs, has been arrested. And he's facing charges on terrorism. He's facing 25 years in jail, okay? Now, I've learned his story, and from what I've understood, he did everything legally and by the book because he was very well aware of what the Tucson police were needing him to do. But eventually he became a problem because his activism was so strong. And what happened is be, he was framed on charges of terrorism, and he's facing 25 years in jail right now. June 30th, July 30th is when his trial starts, okay? So, what I'm prepared to do is go on the road and advocate for Chris. I want to meet act activist groups in person, give them a PowerPoint presentation, and tell them that no matter what kind of activist group you are, whether it's anti-geoengineering, anti-vaccination, anti-fluoridation, anti-5G, anti-fracking, no matter what kind of activity you're engaged in, what's happening in Tucson could be a precedent because Chris did everything legally and yet the state clamped down on him, okay? So if this precedent is allowed to stand, we're going to be having a problem here in America because activism is going to be leaned on by the state and what they're looking for is no one to say anything. Well, I'm going to say something. I'm prepared to take this van on the road next week and stay on the road until July 30th. I want to shine as much light on what's happening in Tucson as I possibly can. And with your help, I can do that. Now, when I came back from being the opening speaker of Matt Landman's Stop Geoengineering Summit uh, May 12th in Tucson, transmission gave out. So to get the van back on the road and to fix the turn signals and to get the van legally registered and insured is going to take $5,000, okay? Now, you might ask yourself, why am I restoring an old van? Here's the answer. This van does not have OnStar, GPS, sophisticated computer sensors, or any EMFs that are radiating around the inside of it. So for me personally, as I go forward in my life, I would rather restore an older vehicle, which I've had for 11 years, and make sure that I drive without EMFs irradiating myself. So, to get this fixed, I've opened a Patreon account. I'll give you the address, www.patreon forward slash John Knox activist. And that's all one word, lower, lower case. So it's www.patreon forward slash John Knox activist. If you can donate to getting this van back on the road and getting me out on the road, I think it's going to be a very, very good thing for activism in general. Think about it. Chris Haskell is us. We may be Chris Haskell if we up our activist activities. But if we do that and these people in Tucson are allowed to get away with what they're trying to get away with, then you're always going to be looking behind your back to worry about whether the state's going to crack down on you just because they don't like what you're doing. I can't have that. Okay? So I'm John Knox. I'm cultivating my common sense. And I'm finding out that there's more and more reasons to stay curious.